Fifth graders, today we are covering topic 5-8. The objective you need to write in your math spiral is, you have already solved many different kinds of problems. Today you will learn to decide whether information you need to solve a problem is missing or whether you have extra information. Pause now to write the objective. When have you had to solve a problem outside of school? but you did not have enough information to do so. One example I had was, I wanted to know if I had enough money to buy a video game. I knew how much I had saved, but I did not know the exact cost of the game. Please get your problem solving recording sheet, Teaching Tool 1, to work on now. Write the problem. Juno rides his bike twice as far on Sunday as he does on Saturday. How many miles does he ride on Sunday? For the no box, please write, what information are you given? Well, Juno rides twice as far on Sunday as he does on Saturday. Write that in the no box now. What do you need to find? What does the problem ask you to find? How far Juno rides on Sunday is what the problem asks. Please put that in the find box. In the strategies box, I'm going to draw a picture, so I check draw a picture. Next, in the show, your, show the problem, I draw boxes, like so. Please do so now and show the problem. After I draw the picture, I make an explanation so that I understand the picture when I come back to it. So how do the two bars represent the information in the problem? The small bar is for miles Juno rides on Saturday. The long bar is the miles he rides on Sunday. It has two parts, each as long as the small bar because he rides twice as far on Sunday as on Saturday. Please write that in the show the problem box also. For the solution, they didn't give me the number, so I will make something reasonable up. I'm going to go ahead and put 10 miles. Please write 10 miles for the solution, and then, since it's twice as much on Sunday, it should be 20 miles. Is it reasonable? Yes. So my solution was 10. My answer would be 20. And check reasonable? Yes. People can ride 20 miles. So please fill in solution, answer, and check reasonable. Let's practice. Another problem. So now you need another problem solving recording sheet. Please write for the problem, an adult male gorilla eats about 40 pounds of food each day, an adult female gorilla eats about half as much food, how many pounds of food does, each, uh, does an adult male gorilla eat in one week? So my problem really is only how many pounds of food does an adult male gorilla eat in one week? I don't really need to write the rest. Please write it now in the problem box. What do I know? What information do you need to solve the problem? That's what you'd find. Is 40 pounds per day and seven days. Please write that in the no box. What do I need to find? The number of the total pounds of food. Please write that in the find box. For strategies, I'm going to draw a picture again. So I will check draw a picture. And in show the problem, here's my picture. I have 40 pounds for seven times for seven days. Please draw that, draw that out and show the problem box. For my solution, I will either add 40 seven times or I will Multiply 40 times 7. 
please write one of those in the solution box. Pause the video now. After I solved the problem, I got 280 pounds. Don't forget your label. Put this in your answer box now. Then, of course, I check to see if it's reasonable, and yes, it is. Next, was there any inf extra information that I didn't need? Yeah, I didn't need to know that the female gorilla eats about half as much for this problem. For this problem, you will not need a problem-solving recording sheet. Please listen. Lacey is buying dried fruit to feed her pet bird. How much will it cost to feed the bird for one month? What information do we know to solve the problem? Well, we don't. We don't know the cost of the dried fruit and how much the bird eats in a month. We need to know both of those to be able to do this problem. So this problem is not possible to solve. So therefore, no problem solving recording sheet was needed. Most problems will be solvable. It is rare that you come across a problem that does not have enough information. Now for your, ch for your challenge, write a problem that has information missing or has all the information needed to solve the problem with extra information. Trade problems. If the problem is missing information, make up reasonable information and solve it.